The technique of putting several similar shots together is called match cut. Well, the editing tip can actually make some similarly average footage become more interesting and animated. If you want to learn more about match cut editing, go check out the related tutorial made in our channel, and I will put a link in the screen. In today's video, we are going to show you how to achieve a match cut with the transition process effect in Video Pro Vlogger. So if you are interested in this, then keep watching. Fade Transition In this case, we are going to use the fade transition to overlap the similar elements in the two frames and create a match cut effect which would make the transition look more natural and smooth. Open the software, import the two clips we need, drag the car footage into video track first, scale the timeline to a right size, then use a ripple edit to cut the video to the right length. Click Motion to open Motion Editor. Here let's do a zooming effect to create a fake camera movement. Add a keyframe to the first frame. Drag the box to place a vehicle in the center of the frame. Then drag the playhead to the last frame. Drag the frame to create a zooming out effect. But be sure to keep the row right in the middle of the screen. Click Apply and return to the main interface. Now here we have an effect of camera being pulling away. Drag the second clip into the video track and place it right behind the first clip. We use the Ripple Editor to cut. Click Motion to enter Motion Editor. As before, we create the same zooming out effect. Here we need to find a leaf vein in the frame, so that it can match a road in the first clip. Add a keyframe in the first frame. Then we drag the box to keep the vein in the center of the frame. Then, add a keyframe to the last frame to zoom out the shot. Click Apply. Find Fade Effect in Transition Library. Add it in between the two clips. Now, a Match Cut Effect is built and added. The second example is Zoom Blur. In this case, we use a lamp behind a character as a match element. And from there, we create a match cut effect. First, import the footage into the software. Then, put the first clip into video track. Adjust it to a proper length. Put a second clip into the overlay track. Adjust the size of the image. Now we need to resize the images of the two clips to ensure the characters appear the same size. Adjust the transparency of the second clip. Drag the playhead and we can see that the character in the first clip are smaller than that in the second clip. Select this button to lock the overlay track. Then select the first clip and adjust the scale parameter in the transform here on the right and get the two characters overlapped. Then, unlock the overlay track, drag the second clip back to the video track. Then, adjust the transparency back to 1. Find the zoom blur in the transition library. Put it in between the two clips.
Now you've reached the end of today's video about how to use transition process to achieve match cut effect in Video Pro Vlogger. I think you've got it. Anyway, don't forget to click the subscribe button to subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet. We'll see you soon in our next video. Hope you enjoy. Bye bye.